Nobara or Bazite? Which Linux gaming distro should you actually use in 2025? Both are Fedora-based and made for gaming, but they take very different paths. Let's break it down. Nobara Linux, created by Glorious Eggroll, comes packed with gaming tools, NVIDIA drivers, and Proton patches right out of the box. It's perfect for gamers switching from Windows who just want things to work, Steam, OBS, Wi-Fi, controllers, all set after install. Bazite, on the other hand, is built on Fedora Atomic and mimics the Steam OS experience. It's stable, polished, and designed for both PCs and handhelds like the Steam Deck or ROG Ally. It's the go-to if you want that console-style plug-and-play gaming feel. Performance, Nobara runs Proton titles a bit smoother with slightly higher FPS, while Bazite uses fewer background resources but trades a few frames. Both deliver great performance, especially on AMD. System design, Nobara is traditional. You can tweak and install freely. Bazite is immutable, meaning safer updates and easy rollbacks if something breaks. Ease of use, Nobara is beginner-friendly. Everything works out of the box. Bazite looks amazing and feels like Steam OS, but its immutable structure can confuse new users. Focus, Nobara shines on desktops. Bazite dominates on handhelds and anyone who loves that stable, console-like setup. Choose Nobara for maximum performance and easy customization. Pick Bazite for handheld gaming or if you prefer stability and Steam Deck vibes. It all depends on whether you want a flexible desktop or a console-like experience. Which one fits your gaming setup? Comment below. Like, subscribe, and game on.